once you stop eating yourself to death, okay, your body gets to eat yourself back into health. So at the cell level, what's happening is hunger is very healing. The idea is this, folks, keep it real simple. Hunger is healing. So you need to be hungry every day. That's why intermittent fasting can be so effectual because what intermittent fasting does the way most people practice it is that there's a 16 hour window from the time you last ate the day before until you eat again the next day. And what that 16 hours does, about 12 of those hours at least are really dedicated to digestion. So you're not actually in fasting state yet. But what it does enable you to do is get about four hours, the beginning early stages of autophagocytosis at the cell level. So you get about four hours of healing in there, especially when you've gotten that signal in that you're like, hey, I'm getting really hungry. It's like 16, we're getting close. When's that? You start looking at the clock. When's the 16 hours up? That's when you know your body's healing. So you need to give that to yourself every day. And it's a discipline thing, but it's a discipline thing that's going to pay dividends so much for this reason that four hours adds up. So when you do it for a whole week, by the end of the week, four times seven is 28. That's 28 hours of autophagocytosis you've given your cells of your body. What I wanted to show everybody was this. This is the what's going on within a cell, right? So a cell, when it's just finished um, replicating itself, it'll go into what's called interphase. And during interphase, all right, getting getting ready for the next cell replication, these things take place. The cell will go through these things, absorb nutrients, produce energy, produce enzymes to metabolize, build things, and then get rid of the waste. But then there's this sixth stage. And this sixth stage, what the cell likes to do is go into this sixth stage before it goes into the process of, of uh, mitosis, of making a, a new cell. The reason it does autophagocytosis is so that it can clean up the inside of the cell as best as it can to create the healthiest version of the cell for that replication. But when you are eating three times a day or snacking continuously throughout the day, what you're doing is never giving your body a chance to get into autophagocytosis because it resets every single time you put new foods in. And then so cells will have to replicate, but they'll have to replicate having never gone into autophagocytosis for that final healing. And that's why it's so important to be hungry every day and give yourselves a chance to replicate the healthiest version that that cell can replicate itself as. To me, this is the new lifestyle we have to do. It's not just about eating organic foods anymore. Um, it's about saying I am definitely throughout my month either practicing intermittent fasting every day or getting into, if I can't do that, three days of water fasting every month, or maybe both, like, because that's what I do. When you're hungry, your body is healing. It's designed to replicate the healthiest version of itself every single time. And I think that's the message. If you, you can eat yourself to death, but hunger is healing. Yeah. Right? So I think we yeah. got simple ways to keep all this super simple so thanks for having me today i can't wait to come on next week and do it again yeah all right thank you so much dr ely see you next week have a great one all right thanks alexis peace everybody <laughs>